Okay, I would continue with my thinking experiment about physics. Sounds interesting. What's your experiment about? Well,、um, I still believe impl implicated order and five-dimensional space provides a framework for understanding the whole universe. I have two points to support that conclusion. One is about light performance very near to the black hole or inside the black hole, because the black hole make the space warped, but the light would change their way and get distorted rather than go very straightforwardly. That's a really fascinating idea. So, what's the second point?、Uh, okay,、uh, regarding the first point. I mean, something is restricting the light when the space is warped. So that must be very special about、uh, something that is restricting the light. What do you think that something could be? Okay, that means the five D space is not vacuum. It's not empty. There is something inside. For example, the implicated order infra cells. Plank cells and、uh, dark matter. That's an intriguing thought. So, how do you think this implicated order and dark matter in five D space might affect other phenomena in the universe? Okay.、Um, at this moment, I cannot tell that.、Uh, we are talking about some theoretical physics. Okay, I would answer you the question. I would talk about the second point. The second point is about mathematical equation, because gravitational force and the electromagnetism can only be unified with the mathematical equations in five D space with the concept of five D space. That proves the existence of five D space, and why it cannot be unified in the four D space or three D space. That's because five D space is very special. That's really deep. Do you think we'll ever be able to prove the existence of this five D space? Well,、um, mathematical equations has already proved that. You know, mathematics is the final essential language of the universe. That's the key point. That's a bold statement, but it makes sense. Math does seem to describe the universe in a very fundamental way.